One of our listeners invented a brand new game that he played on a first date. Ooh. And I guarantee people everywhere will be talking about it for years to come. Wow. Hey, hey, hey. Talking about it even, Or huh? maybe just trying to forget it. Because oh. <laughs> it was unconventional. It okay. involved a computer, some raw fish, huh. and oh. socks flying everywhere. Hey, hey. Socks? That sounds like a good date to me. Yeah, you're going to hear how it works. And, Brooke, you can even write down the rules if oh. you want to play yourself. Okay. Hey, it's coming hey. up in a brand new second date update next. <laughs> The best things in life are worth waiting for. Oh, yeah, I could say. I, yeah. I would agree with that. Like Alexis's extremely complicated coffee orders. Mm. Oh, it's so <laughs> worth it. Yeah. Takes them 20 minutes to put them together, but when they come out, amazing. Oh, best or part of my day. Jose's back hair removal strips he ordered from China. Um, yeah. Got delayed again. Oh, buddy. Oh, it's okay. They'll be here. It's going to be worth <laughs> the wait. Two years, I can't wait. But one of our listeners, Ryan, says he's been waiting weeks to finally meet up with the girl that he's been talking to online. Uh -oh. And he says when it happens, it's going to be worth it. Wait, when it happens. Hey. Ryan, welcome to the show, man. Hey, how are you? We're good. But, like, usually when people call in, it's because they've already gone on a date mm -hmm. with somebody. Have you not hung out with this girl yet? Uh, I mean, kind of. It was like a virtual date. Oh. Oh, okay. Hot. So spicy. Okay. Yeah. Well, hey, that's actually a newer <laughs> thing that's been happening. People like to go on Zoom dates first. It's almost like a practice, like exactly. a trial. It's mm -hmm. worth your time. Yeah. Exactly. And then you go on the real date. So who is the girl that you met with? What's her name? I met a girl named Katrina. Total bombshell. Absolute 10. Bombshell. <laughs> oh. Do people still use that term, huh? In Love Island, a hot new bombshell oh, entered the villa. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like All fashion. Right. The words just come back in yeah. style every, right. like, 50 years. Okay. She was the bee's knee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's, uh, what's her deal? The thing is, she lives eight blocks away from me. She lives right down Whoa. the street. Did she offer that information or did you just find it out? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Good question. No, no, she told me that because I was going to pick her up for the date. And then so she told me, you know, where she lives or whatever. Oh. oh, and you're like, oh, my God, that's oh. right by me. Like, what are the chances? Hey, it happens. I remember matching with a girl once, and she literally lived in the alley behind me. <laughs> oh, no, not in, in the, the alley. What? I meant, like, <laughs> hold uh, on. She we, shared... <laughs> we shared an alley. She lived in the apartment Dude, complex behind mine. You're going but... after my type now, Jose. <laughs> but... I'm a little bit confused then. If she only lives eight blocks away, how has it taken you weeks to arrange a meetup? It feels like it should have Why happened by now. Why do a virtual one? Yeah, you, yeah what? Zoom, you can just well, yell out your know. window. They probably didn't know until they were talking on uh, Zoom yeah, about true. the distance. Yeah, so I thought, like, I'm like, this is great, right? So we had this date planned out, and the night of the date, she ends up texting me, and she's like, I am so, so sorry. I've been sick. I'm under the oh, weather. Uh, oh, no. Okay. You, you right. believed her? I mean, yeah, I guess, you know, like I Zoomed her, you know, so she she said she wants to see me. So she's like, let's do a Zoom thing. Oh, OK. Oh, okay. So she didn't cancel completely on yeah. you. She still I see. had the interaction. Yeah. How, how was the okay. Zoom date? It was OK. It wasn't like my ideal idea for a date, but it was I was like, whatever, let's do it. Yeah. Well, and so, she's not feeling great either. So it's like interesting. You don't want to get sick yeah. either yeah. or something. Right, right. So we hop on the video chat and, you know, she's wearing her sweats or whatever, but she's looking really good. You know, she still looked super cute. Mm -hmm. um, I offered to Venmo her to pay for dinner. So that way, you know, it's like, so nice, oh, bro. what a you know, gentleman. That's when, cute. When girls are sick. I always like to offer, hey, I'll send you, uh, you know, soup or some Gatorade. It's just a nice gesture. I thought it was nice. She declined that, though. She said she's got plenty of a food at her house. Um, she was yeah. just going to eat what she had. I was like, OK, that's cool. You know, whatever. But you offered, so you get yeah. points still. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, points are still on the board, I thought, you know. All right. Were you able to have a connection with her, like... God, Zooms it's are yeah. always so awkward for yeah, me. Yeah, like agree. whenever we do like client zooms or stuff. I mean, they're they're good, but they're not as good as just being like, in. Do person. you look at yeah. yourself or the person? I know, Plus, and then like there's always that <laughs> second of delay. And not only is it like a Zoom call, and all the problems will come with that, but she's sick I too. Know. Like we're able to make it romantic. Absolutely, like we were flirting. Oh. Uh, we were both drinking wine. We were laughing. Um, oh, she's oh, my kind of sick girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, okay. It makes you feel better, right? Yeah. Uh, alcohol is supposed to do that. something. Yeah. Yeah. I, you know, and we played this little game. It was so, so sexy. It was like called Strip Sushi. Oh. oh. Strip Sushi. Whoa. I like it. I don't know what it is yet, but she's I like it. She's in her sweatpants drinking <laughs> wine <laughs> playing <eating> sushi <laughs> while she has the flu. Well, explain. <laughs> what is Strip Sushi? I've never heard of that before. 
Yeah, so like I would eat a piece of sushi and then she would take off a piece of clothing and then like vice versa, you know? I just oh. see you like uh, shoving what? as much <laughs> sushi into your mouth as humanly possible. It sounds like a one-sided game. No, he said vice versa. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I thought, I'm yeah. sorry, I just heard the first part. I'm like, so you just eat, she gets naked, so then, you just then what happens? Yeah. <laughs> How much sushi did you put down that night, Ryan? <laughs> I ate a lot of sushi. Yeah. Yeah. Bad, bloated, naked He's at the like, end of it. I have mercury poisoning. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, how many layers of clothes do you have on? Good lord. Okay. Oh man. Was, did you feel the chemistry there? Was that was absolutely, it... absolutely great chemistry? You Dude. know, and I was like, when are we gonna hang out again? I bet you were. <laughs> like you want to play strip sushi yeah. face to face? This, this sounds yeah. so fun. This well, is a great vibe already. And what a bold first date. I know. You know. So how so, did it end? Yeah. So she said this. Her words were like, "I want to hang out as soon as possible. I need to see you." Oh. oh. Okay. So two days later. Her account is completely inactive. Oh, and maybe she's whoa. just ready to concentrate on you. She she found her sushi soulmate. Yeah. So she's like, I don't need this anymore. I, I don't know. I've been texting her and trying to pick a day to hang out. And if I message her, she just changes the subject. But she like says she wants to stay in contact. But like, weird. you know, I don't know if she's seeing somebody else. Like, I, I don't That's know. What it feels like to me. We're just having some sort of reaction to the sushi now. Oh, or she yeah. has like a boyfriend already and that's uh -huh. why she couldn't meet in person. Ooh, uh oh. That's some drama. Same. Yeah, I don't know. But like to have that much fun over Zoom, like I need to see this girl. Like I want to meet up. All right. Okay, yeah. well, let's make oh. that happen for you. We're going to order some sushi to the studio. Ooh. Maybe try to play a little strip sushi ourselves. Should we? <laughs> yeah. I think it's just going to be mostly you taking clothes yeah. off without anyone you and eating me, sushi. Right. Well, we'll at least one coffee. person in this room is going to have fun, and then when we come back, we'll get you your second date update next. Anytime I played strip sushi with someone, oh. they never deactivate their profile. Oh, mm. Jeffrey. And if you're just tuning in. You're just like rubbing it in? <laughs> what? I'm just saying, they always want to do it again. They're just ordering okay. more sushi as the last one. Or they're finding done. other people on yeah. the line. Like, what's wrong with you on the line? Why I like is she calling to you back? think of it my way. Okay. okay. But if you're just tuning in wondering, what is this guy talking oh. about? One of our listeners, Ryan, had a Zoom date recently with a lady named Katrina. And unfortunately, she wasn't feeling well. Yeah. And that's why instead they chose to meet up virtually. And they had food, wine. By the end of the night, someone was getting unagi. Oh, hey, that was pretty good. That's eel. Which is, yeah, yeah Japanese yeah, for eel, eel, but it, it sounds a little bit like naughty, and that's like pretty it. much what I can come Ugaki. up with when we're talking about sushi here. But yeah. the weird part is, ever since, she's been kind of avoiding him and even deactivated her dating profile, yeah. which is a little wow. bit odd. Well, I just think it's odd from the beginning. You're, you claim you're sick, and then you're up for playing strip yes. sushi with someone. <laughs> I was you don't really say, feel hot when you're sick. No. Mm. Also, we assume she deactivated, but you can block people on dating apps, too. So she may still be active, just really doesn't like this Ouch. 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 You saying, and Jeff are piling on him. I'm just saying there's options. There's other options. You guys do bring up some valid points, and I'd like some answers, but mm -hmm. I, I just kind of want to meet up with her and have fun again more okay. than anything. All right. I bet well, you do. We're going we're gonna to try and do that for you. And you know what? If it doesn't work out, just send me your Zoom. You and I can play some strip oh, sushi hey. together. All right, brother? Let's just... Sounds good. Okay. We're gonna... sushi strip, strip any food, it's really. sushi train. Yeah. Let's just... We're going to call Katrina. Here we go. What? Hmm. What? Hello? Hi, Katrina? This is she. Hey, um, my name is Jeff from a radio show called Brooke and Jeffrey in the Morning, and uh, we wanted to talk to you. All right. <laughs> um, what are you uncomfortable about? I just had visions of her playing the game. Oh, okay, let's oh, not do that. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah. Hi, um, Katrina. <laughs> hello. Hi. Hey, I don't know if you've ever heard of us. We're Brooke and Jeffrey in the Morning. We do a segment called a Second Date Update, and we'd like you to be a part of it. And that's just me uh, asking because you're already on it. Yeah. So you kind of have to say yes. Oh, okay. But, but it's good. It means that somebody really likes you and wants to see you again. That's really nice. But um, my answer is no. No, thank you. You don't oh. even know what it is yet. Uh, we're like halfway through it already. Aren't you curious? Mm. Curiosity would kill me. Yeah. What if we put a California roll down on the table? Oh, then no. would you be down? 
funny. Excuse me? Yeah. Imitation crab get you going? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we heard from one of our listeners named Ryan that the two of you had a really fun Zoom date the other night. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Was that sarcastic? I mean, he told us that you turned a Zoom date into, like, a really fun, yeah, hot, saucy night. Yeah, saucy night, which is, I mean, I think. Soy saucy night. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Why do I love that so much? Yeah. Um, <laughs> did you have fun? Well, not as much fun as you guys sound like you're having right now. <laughs> That's a good point. And I'm sorry about that, but we're just trying to help out Ryan because he is really confused because after that night, He's having a really hard time getting the two of you to meet up in person. And he even said that your dating profile was deactivated. Yeah. So the thing is, um, Ryan is, like, really cute. Okay. And I I really like him. Uh-huh. Um, there's just something that I kind of left out. Uh, um, like the wasabi? You- is that what you left out? No. Ooh. It's a pickled ginger. So- oh, yeah. <laughs> can't forget that. No. What are, what'd are you, you leave out? He, okay, he, um, hmm. I don't live where he thinks I live. Oh, oh. He, he, he said, said he, you live really close to him. Please don't tell me you live with a man. Do you live with no. a husband or What's a partner? What's so wrong with men, Brooke? Well, she would be in a relationship. <laughs> Are you, like, oh. living with someone? Is that why? No, I do live by myself. Oh. But I live in Europe. Oh. 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 No. What? Oh, my God! Like you just recently moved in the last week. So what do you mean um, you live in Europe? Explain. So I make different accounts, and it's, they all have the same information on them. But I put them in different locations so I can meet people all around the world. Because oh. if it's true love, I'm willing to go anywhere. Oh, that's pretty romantic. Hey, but if, uh, how that. are you gonna find true love if you're lying to people? And yeah, why don't you have an international phone? That's number? why she's so good at Zoom dates. Yeah, she does we, it all the time. We call their American <laughs> phone number. Right. So I have international call forwarding. So ah, my um, cousin has that actually. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, this could be good. What city are you in? <laughs> Depends. Yeah. Well, well, good place to visit. I mean, yeah. why why are you hiding this from Ryan? Why can't Ryan know that you live in Europe? I didn't want him to, like, not be interested because yeah. I didn't live near him. Oh, immediately. Well, if a yeah, girl no one lives wants... more than, like, an hour yeah. away, you're like, never mind. And <laughs> I do long distance out of the get-go. Yeah. Like, he no. said that you told him you were sick. I knew a woman wouldn't play strip sushi <laughs> if she was ill. Yeah. It just wasn't going to happen. All right, here so... comes my top off. <laughs> uh... I did feel a little sick after the game, if that counts for anything. <laughs> Nauseous from the wine. Sushi and wine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, okay. I don't know how Ryan is going to feel about hearing that information. Oh, it's boy. a huge bomb to drop. Yeah. yeah. And it has already dropped because Ryan is on the other line right now, Katrina. <laughs> oh, um, okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. She- Ryan. Oh. Yeah. Uh-oh. Hey, Ryan. Yikes. Um, you, you're in Europe? I am currently in Europe, yes. Okay. But, but so, I, didn't, I didn't tell you because I liked you and I didn't want oh. me not being where you were to inhibit us getting to know one another. <laughs> she sounds nervous yeah. now. <laughs> Ryan, are you down with European girls? Is that cool? <laughs> okay, so like, is it like a passport thing or is it like a, about money? <laughs> no, no, no. It's definitely not about the money. Um, <laughs> like she wants to marry him for citizenship. Yeah. <laughs> like if you want or if you wanted to like have a date, that yeah. would be a really, really expensive date. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. yeah. Like if you wanted to have like an in-person date, you would just have to like wire me some funds for like a oh, plane ticket and like a hotel. What? I haven't wired since I got a fake ID. That's so <laughs> illegal. Oh, <laughs> oh, like, just flies just, I don't well, get it. Like, what's your plan then? Your plan is to meet a guy and then hope that the guy pays for you to go to him? It yeah. is traditional for a man to pay for the first date. <laughs> oh, Jeff is right. So. And actually, I think they should at least go Dutch. Here. I've, always, I've always agreed. I mean, she is Dutch. So. Yes, yeah, European. <laughs> It's a European way. Yeah. <laughs> is that something you're willing to do, Ryan? Would you be willing to pay for no. a plane ticket? I mean, like, I'm open to talking her with her about it. Oh. Mm. 
not completely closed off to this idea. Whoa. Oh. Strip sushi, the way to a man's heart. Yeah. <laughs> You know, I, I'm going to be truthful and admit that I'm I'm bummed out that you're not eight blocks away from me. Like I was, yeah. I thought that was kind of cool. Now she's like eighteen hours. Yeah, Why did she away say so close? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, you're not mad at her though for lying? Well, I mean, I get what she's saying about like wanting to find true love and stuff. Like, you know, I feel similarly mm-hmm. to that. Aww. Okay, so, well, let's try and make this happen for you, two. That's really cute. Um, Wait, you want to pay for the flight. What's your credit card <laughs> oh, number? Yes. <laughs> Ryan? Let's not rush them. I mean, Katrina, are, are you cool with this? Are you cool with Ryan paying for... Yeah, he would just have to give me the money so I could buy my own ticket. Um, oh. I'm just really particular about, like, the airlines and oh. where I sit. I've just had really bad... A.K.A. Days. first class, baby. I want that bed no, on that no, oh. I think it's yeah. A.K.A. It's a scam. Exactly. Yeah. Alexis, oh. are you falling for it, too? <laughs> I I would have have my scam? God. Women just take their clothes off and men just do yeah. the dumbest thing. I would have fallen for this in a heartbeat. I'd be like, oh, I get it. You I don't even know if that class. was her on Zoom. Oh, here, here's $10,000. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> uh, I, I could buy her the ticket. But Make sure no, the she says she, she says wants. that she doesn't want you to buy the ticket. She wants the money to buy the ticket herself. She wants the airline miles. Yeah. I don't think so. Okay. I mean, I've just never done this before. It's like kind of new to me. Okay. So when when can we get this set up? Are we going to do this in the next <laughs> no, like, week? Oh, I want to do a follow up with. Doing them. it in the next month. Oh, yeah. God. Ooh. We could do it today. Today. Oh, I, bet today. Oh, I, I bet we could. I bet we could. Okay. <laughs> She'll allow him to send her money. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, the earlier you order the plane tickets, the cheaper they are. Oh, that's, that's right. What also it is. true. So, I've heard Tuesdays okay. are actually the best days. All right. Ooh, yeah. We should have done this awkward Tuesday then. Ryan, we'll let you two talk so you can give her all of your uh, financial information, okay? <laughs> hey, Ryan, let's talk without everyone else around so we could get all the details squared away. Uh oh. No, not uh oh. Privacy is very important. No, they're just going to be playing some strip sushi. You know know what you guys uh are really doing. All right. (laughs) Congratulations, you two. Thank you, guys. Good luck. I'm sure we're going to be reading about you in the newspaper coming up real soon. (laughs) What? What does that mean? (laughs) Are you still not getting it right? You know, like famous international love story. No, that's what I mean. That's what you're talking about. Sure. Oh, we're going to go or, viral on Instagram. Or oh possibly he lost his kidney in Russia. And here's his tell-all story. <laughs> no.